Welcome back ladies and gentlemen, I am Captain Kokomo and we are back in Astroneer. The new 1.1 update is only what I can guess days away because it has been taken off the beta. You can no longer opt into it so that generally means that they are moving it to a release phase. If this is incorrect then I do apologize. But for the update, there are a few, I'll, I'll go over, over a little bit the list of what uh, will be in the update. Uh, extra large freighter has been added to the game. T tired of wrecking rovers and research chambers littered across the landscape. Change changed your mind with about that fourth smelter in your base. No worries. Now, no more. Worry no more because the extra large shredder is here to clean up the mess. It can, uh, blah, 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 blah. It will now shred atmospheric condenser, the, con the chemistry lab, the exodynamics research aid expanded pyramid top. So those capsules that you pop off, it can shred the top of those. Uh, the, the large printer, the large seed, the three seater, the large shredder, it can shred a shredder. That's a powerful shredder. Large storage, partially wrecked medium platform, research module, smelter, soil centrifuge, trade module, uh, wrecked medium platform, wrecked research module, wrecked rover, wrecked, uh, wrecked smelter. And it will be printable from the large printer at the cost of two tungsten carboid and two steel. The byte cost to research the extra large shredder is going to be 5,000 bytes. Whew, that uh, was a mouthful. The extra large platform C will also be re released in this 1.1 patch, and that will be the primary housing for the extra large shredder. I uh, will chuck a graphic up of it right there. And we will. There is new mantle layers there's like new layers of under the surface of Visadia, Kalidor and Glacio and they've also added new plants and stuff uh, research samples and research items have also been updated as well there's new um, they've rebalanced all the research basically you need more research to unlock the, the things but you get more research I don't know how it works but that's the deal of it they're trying to make the game a little bit more extended keep you in the game a little bit more instead of being able to lock unlock almost everything within the first couple of hours uh i don't play a customization preview so you all those suits that you unlock you can now preview them before you get into the game which is absolutely wonderful uh Increase the bite cost of all non-starter catalog items by 25%. Uh, so everything like the augments, the fireworks, the dynamite, the medium generator, the medium solar, the everything in the medium category, extra large category, and yeah, the drills, the crane, winch, trade platform, solar array. Yeah, that was all. That all has been increased by 25%, the research cost. Uh, the general updates will be rover auxiliary slot control now correctly adapts to the direction of the rover the, uh, the, 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 the rover seat is facing. Uh, client players in a multiplayer game can now impact Zebra, Leo and Checkerballs with rovers. So you can have your own little version of Rocket League in the game. Uh, structures in the center of every planet, planet and mo moons now supply free oxygen. Uh, tuned transition speed to get in and out of all kinds of seats to feel better. Okay, and there's going to be a whole he heap of uh, performance upgrades and system optimizations and things like that. The tethers will be getting another overhaul so you can... They'll, the game will run even smoother with the more tethers you have. 
But anyway, I think I've prattled on enough. There are just more bug fixes. I'll put a link down below just so you can go over the list yourself and have a look. But for now, let's get back into where we left off. Okay, here we are. We're back on Glacio, at Research Base Glacio. And we are running out of research. So we are going to... And we need to get... Ooh, I hear wind all around me. But there is no research. What's going on? There's no power. Alright. Well, let's go underground. Go exploring again. Here we go. Here we go. I love doing that. Hang 10 squared. That's the achievement I just got for doing that all the way down. Alright, I need to find some... I need to find some... Uh, yeah, this stuff. Oh, but I can't dig it up. I really need, need to bring a drill down here. Compound is going to be a thing, isn't it? Alright, I have enough for some tethers. Let's go back to the... Oh. Oh, here we go, over here. Oh, I nearly got lost. Alright, let's make those tethers before we go any further. And actually, a small oxygen tank wouldn't go astray. And I think it might be a good idea just to make the oxygen tank. I just need one glass. Which won't be hard to do. And... Oh, get rid of these two. Oh, that sucks. That wasn't meant to happen. Alright. I've got plenty of bloody compound up here. Why didn't I take it with me? Let's make the tethers. Don't have any quartz up here. No. Alright, let's go back down, grab my body, and we will all be set. Okay. What happened to the rest of the glass? I'm pretty sure I had more on there. Oh, quartz. Yeah, it's kind of annoying that I can't dig into this stuff. I, know, I understand the reason why, but it's still annoying. They want you to research higher tiers of digging implements and whatnot, which is fair enough, but still. That means you have to bring a... a vehicle down here, and yeah. It's annoying. Oh, I've got a I've got one. Why don't you all tell me about that? Alright, we're going back up. We have to go back around. Up around here. And we're going to make an oxygen tank. Because we bloody need one. So when the wind picks up, I can hear the wind. When we get more wind down here, there we go. For some reason, it's only with this game. I put the smelter on this side, but I hear it out of this side of my headset. I don't know why. It's the, this is the only game that it happens with. And if anyone has an idea out there how to fix that, then let me know.
And now we have an oxygen tank. And it's filling up wonderfully. Let's go back down. We need to find more research down there. Oh, excuse me. Sorry about that, guys. Oh, what do we have here? We have... We have... Oh, can't, because I didn't pick up anything. Stop it. Taking a risk. Jumping in. This, oh, this is that titan, ti, titanium. I can't speak. Every time I get on here with you guys, I can't speak. Titanite. They got creative with that name, didn't they? That was sarcasm, by the way. There's a fine line between sarcasm and complaining. I try to not to complain, but it always comes out as that. So let's see if I can't get back up out of here, because that would be fantastic and wonderful. Okay. There we go. We are going to go back up and refine this little product, titanite. So we got some titanium. Let's go up here. Just, just, just for curiosity's sake, let's go up here. What is this? No, it's just not. Just organic. Come on, get out. Oh, where are we? Oh, this is where we are. Research is done. Excellent. Good timing. And how much is this one worth? Seven thousand! Seven bloody thousand! Probably should get a couple of those research modules underway. Should I explore this? Oh, I should probably go and power that thing up. You know what? That's going to be a goal. Next goal, we're going to power that thing up. Which means I'm going to need you, and I'm going to need... Yeah, I probably will need that. I'm going to need you. Oh, I don't, I'm not going to have enough storage. I'll leave you behind. Um... Do I, can I make wind vanes? I can make small wind vanes. That will that might help. I'm gonna need glass for those. Which means I'm gonna need quartz. Which means I'm gonna use this for the quartz. We have plenty of wind on this planet, it's not a problem. Just a matter of making it consistent enough. That's going to be the issue. Yeah, see what I mean? I'm going to research batteries as well. Small battery, I need lithium that I do not know where to get. Can anyone tell me where to get lithium? Is it from the atmospheric condenser? Because I think that's where it's from. Alright, um, maybe I'm going to need to take some generators with me instead of wind vanes, which means I probably shouldn't have researched the wind vanes, which, yeah, tough luck. Alright, I'm going to make some generators. Five generators should be enough, shouldn't it? Well, we're going to find out anyway, because we're going to need to make some tethers as well to get over there. Uh, tether bundle. What? 
Oh, where's the button? Oh, I have no power. Ooh, that's just a small problem. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yep, you're not gonna let me because I need like three bars or something. Don't have enough bars. All right, I'll be back when I've got power. All right, that should be enough power because it, the wind just died again. We have two bundles of tethers. That should be enough. You would think so, anyway. Anyway, let's head on over there. I think once we get over there and try to unlock the dooby, that might be it for this episode. Alright, so to save you the journey, I will get over there myself. Okay, we made it, and it seems like I thought that the underground, the underground gates would be the ones to provide oxygen, but it seems the, hang on, let me get far, far enough away. I'm not losing oxygen. Oh, I am out of my tank. Hang on, there we go. I am lo losing it out of the tank. Are the above ground ones doing it too? I'm not gonna... No, they're not. All right, just making sure. Excellent. We are here. And there is a bit of iron right there. And compound that we will probably need. Let's get... Just clear off the platform. Nobody likes to work in a messy workstation. Is there more wind vanes over here somewhere? Oh no, that's because it was behind me because I hear it out of the wrong side of my bloody headphones. There's no working... Oh, it doesn't work. Yeah, there are no working platforms around here where I can use that wind vane. Which is a pain in the butt. Maybe, can you plug these into here? Is that a thing? Let's just test that out, shall we? No. Hang on, I don't think you can. Hang on. Stop. Place it down there. No, you can't. That's a shame. I could just make a small platform with a printer. I do have... I can make a small printer. Oh, that might help. I think I'll do that. Alright, be right back. Okay, we are... We have our little platform. And now we can transfer this onto here. And maybe, no, we can't. All right, we're gonna need to put this platform at the end of the little daisy chain. Producing a minimum amount of power. We need so much more. Yeah, we need so much more. But anyway, tune in next episode to see if we can't unlock this bad boy and uh, get one step closer to opening that gate. So, I thank you for joining me on this episode if you've liked anything i've done if you've been informed entertained at all please hit the like button hit the subscribe button and if you are feeling particularly energetic please hit that bell icon as well so you know every time i upload a video but for now i thank you for joining me on this voyage i've been captain kokomo and i will see you on the next one